If sexual experiences were like trading cards, what would be your rarest card? The Mr. Worldwide card. Got bit on the ass by a pit bull during a one-night stand. Had sex with a woman who I have never spoken a word to before. Didn't even know her name. The A Quiet Place card. My first time was a foursome. The run before learning to crawl card. The one time I accidentally told the girl I was having sex with. I love fucking your tight dick. The reverse uno card. Didn't masturbate for two weeks and came in her mouth first time I had sex btw. The I've been saving this for you card. Card, Union Station. I had sex on top of a train before. Ah, the Missionary Impossible card. Girl cheated on me with a close friend. I fucked his mum. The hit them where they came from card. Couldn't get it up on a one-nighter with this girl I knew, whiskey dick. My friend who ridiculed me harshly, had sex with her later that week, got herpes. Tinder date brought her friend along on our first date. She and I just didn't click at all, so we parted ways. Took her friend home instead. My buddy conceived a child the night he lost his virginity with a girl who was also a virgin. They were 18 years old. 11 years later, they are happily married and doing very well for themselves. So I'd consider that card pretty damn rare. Both ends of the spectrum have somehow experienced both a micro penis and a dick so big it wouldn't fit. My mom got the rarest card. She fucked with a 23 yo gigolo, she is 70 yo, and got syphilis. She gave him another strain of syphilis. I was a real quiet, strange, nerdy type in high school. Girls didn't pay me much attention. Fast forward to about 15 years after high school graduation I separated from my wife of 5 years. I remember I opened my Instagram and liked a post from the high school prom queen. Not even a few minutes later she sent me a DM. After causal conversation, we agreed to get drinks, had some bar food and an overall good time. I made my move and ended up getting a blowjob in my truck before the night was over. She ended up being my friend with benefits for about a month or so before we cut ties. The night of the drunken truck blowjob, the 17-year-old version of myself was sitting in the back seat of my head saying you did it. You son of a bitch, you did it, the don't give up on your dreams card. The Navy SEAL's wife and they were swingers. As you can imagine, a lot of SEALs have ridiculously hot wives' girlfriends. I have no idea why she sat down and chatted me up of all the guys at the bar. I was in crappy street clothes and pissed off about a car issue. I was the literal definition of angry and getting drunk. She had us FaceTime with her husband, who was overseas at the time, to get the official thumbs up from him. It was really odd, but that woman was an absolute champion in bed. On the roof of my university card. Achievement unlocked. Higher learning. Had sex with someone from Greenland. Getting a blowjob in the bathroom of a police station lobby from a woman whom I met three hours prior. I was having sex with a girl in the shower, and I had her bent over, and she kept banging her head on the wall, and I was like I'm so sorry you keep hitting your head and she said oh no it's okay I like it and I couldn't tell if she was kidding or not but she wasn't. I was down on my ex, and she came so hard she farted directly into my mouth. I happened to open my mouth at just the right time, so it created a hollowed out reverberation effect that amplified the fart in a strange way. It was not a small fart to begin with. This moment still echoes in my brain. Having a blowjob while drinking a cup of tea, which was great for a couple of minutes until she realized I was still drinking tea. The unknown anal card. First time having sex with this girl, we were teens we did anal, I didn't know I was in her ass, and she didn't say anything, I asked after, if I was in her ass she said I think so, that was her first time doing anal. We are still friends and had sex a few more times over those years, she loves anal. I was once with a girl from a Catholic school who basically called everything down there her butt. Made things awkward. Closest would be bathroom sex at an academic conference 30 minutes before it was my turn to present. The time I drove 1,000 miles to fuck a girl who, objectively, was at least a 9 out of 10, while I'm probably closer to a 5 out of 10 for a week straight. While also going to Comic Con in the time we weren't fucking. And she paid for everything. It was probably the best week of my life. God bless her, I hope she's well. The having sex in an old opera house with a stranger on Halloween and getting caught by some ghost hunter's card. It's foil. Been to a wedding and hooked up with not a bridesmaid, but with the bride and groom. Blowjob after she put chocolate pudding on my dick, very weird change of temperature. Not me but someone else, two brothers. They met a girl who had sex with each of them and afterwards with the father. While mom was on holiday. What a friendly girl I guess. The all in the family card. Blowjob from a girl with no teeth is definitely holographic. Sex with her grandma isn't a cool card, 